men tearing down women, and then women saying they don't need men. That's self-destructive. We supposed to be building each other up, doing construction. Constructive criticism is fine. But whatever happened to men being builders? Jesus said, build one another. Listen to the women speak down on men, and men talk down on women. It's absolutely disgusting. We not building, we destroying one another, tearing down each other. And that's the spirit of Satan. He only came down here to work against God's design. He do destruction. And he like watching us do his bidding. But I'm about my father's business. I'm down here to build up the kingdom. I would never tear down a woman. Even though I have had my moments. I'm God's son. She his daughter. Boy, I got a mama. I got nieces. I got grandmamas. Aunties and little sisters. And one day, I might even be a little girl's father. What we do to them, we do to her. So why would you ever want to destroy her? Me? I'd rather work on myself. Let God do some reconstruction. Than to ever again tear down a woman. Everything you say about a woman. There's a man somewhere who said the same thing about your mama. I thought you said you love your mama. Then why you treat her like that? How we treat a woman reflects what we think of our mother. That's the only reason I ask. She a single woman trying to man up because ain't nobody ever wife her. Now you a grown man putting down women, continuing the very cycle that had all of us growing up with single mothers. But forget what y'all talking about. I'm a builder. I'm a build her. Build with her. When it made that pretty girl my wife working on our marriage, you know, doing construction. Yeah, she got problems. Just like I got problems. But she my problem. I can't solve her, save her, or fix her, but I can love her, just like Jesus loves me. You don't know your own worth. That's why you can't understand hers. We got to be willing to do the work. Brother, you don't even understand your own pain, your own hurts. That's why you don't see nothing wrong with hurting her. And the reason why I'm speaking more to the men is because God left us in charge first. Yeah, it's some women out here bossing up and doing their thing. I came from a single mother. But I will be the first to say that biblically, women were never called to do the work. And I ain't saying that y'all just here to give birth and y'all ain't got to help with the work. I'm just saying that the devil is destroying the nuclear family so that none of us will know our worth. What you do to her, you do to him. If you hurt her, you hurt both of y'all father. Men don't understand that vulnerability is bravery. That's why God said, you are the head. Love her and cover her. Men and women, we both got our insecurities, but we just got to work with each other, hurt with each other, bond with each other, and go through some hurts together. We got to work with each other, not against each other. We got to build each other. God left us down here for reconstruction. And if we tearing each other down, then we working against him. Hey, just make sure y'all building on the right side of the fence. I'm trying to build up the stairway to heaven. I'm trying to help some people get there. For real. And I love y'all from here to heaven. Be a builder. Let God work on you and know your construction worth.